nothing. You lose Repeat after me. I have no talent. They are complete pathetic faggots. Stop the hammering. It's just not easy. There's actually a card game called Shithead. You should check it out sometime and maybe play it somewhere in your shithole country, right? <laughs> oh my god. Cause cause only a Democrat or an Antifa member or a BLM member or some other Democratic hate group member would do this, right? Okay. <laughs> Antifa practicing their tolerance for pain. Okay, let's 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 just let's run by that a couple of thousand times, right? Oh my god. <laughs> 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 uh, okay. <laughs> Let's do this again. I love this. I mean, I can do this. I listen to Antifa member, your life is officially ended. I'm serious. I'm 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 just I I cannot understand. It's just unbelievable. Look at that. Look at this. This is a perfectly beautiful lady who also happens to have demon eyes. Notice the word I use, demonized. But she has demon eyes. So she demonizes everything in sight. That's how you know you're an Antifa member. If, if you if you if you try to staple your mouth and and you end up failing in the most spectacular way. I mean, this is what there is no other way to react to that. One more time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the reactions of her Twitter feed. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Now, there are 326 million people in America. Millions are abortion fanatics, as evidenced by the deranged protesters. Screaming like escaped mental patients during the Kavanaugh hearings. Finding a few to smear this historic nomination isn't unbelievable. It's completely expected. I mean, woman, you got a beautiful face, a full head and long hair. 
you have a brain, why do you never use it? Come on, man. See, this is why abortion clinics are still around, to prevent people like that from ever existing. And, and I'm sorry, I know you're going to hate me from saying, I know you're going to hate me for telling you parents this, but if you give birth to a child and she becomes or he becomes an Antifa member, you should automatically, by default, disown your child and admit to the world through a social media video of your own after said child posts a video of him or herself attempting to staple her goddamn tongue that you creating that child with your spouse in the first place was the biggest mistake you and your spouse could have ever made. Run that by me again. See that again. See that again. Okay, let's see that again. This this person doesn't even know how to spell bitch. Look, 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 look. look. This person doesn't even know how to spell bitch. Fancy bitch. Fancy bick. Or bitch. She doesn't even know. He doesn't even know how to spell bitch. What the hell? Oh. Let's do this again. 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 Once more with feeling. Day eight seventy. You're fired. You're fired. If you have a person like this as your employer, you deserve to go out of business. I'm sorry. I, I, I could I could replay the same video again for 20 hours non-stop and some of you would still not get the picture. How stupid are you people? Are you fucking kidding me? My god. See, this is the reason why I created Savage Level Omega Null to catch people stapling their tongues in front of a webcam while recording themselves during a goddamn live stream. Watch this. One moment. Oh, I think this is going to be cool. This is going to be a great idea. And then the next minute, absolute regret. 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 Ha. And now our Thomas Jefferson moment of the episode is sponsored by a good friend of mine on YouTube, who I'm going to subscribe to right now, named Tommy Flores! With a video called Democrats Saying Stupid Things, .mp4. Obviously, because you have to add the .mp4 there to symbolize that the Democrats are, in fact, the dumbest people on Earth. And I'm not kidding when they say that, when I say that. They really are the dumbest people on Earth. Tommy Flores is just one of the 63 million people voting and... Pointing that out by voting Republican. I mean, I mean, just just look at this. Listen to this. I'm not even gonna show you the video. I'm just gonna let you listen to it. Listen. If we do everything right, we do it with absolute certainty. We stand up there and we make really tough decisions. There's still a 30% chance we're gonna get it wrong. <laughs> Under my plan uh, of a cap and trade system, electricity rates would necessarily skyrocket. <laughs> Hill, looks like Ruben is in the lead, and here comes. <laughs> <Adam. laughs> There were things that uh, I got wrong that, that none of us really uh, knew or anticipated. 
allowing the Bush tax cuts to expire would essentially be tax increase. Well, it isn't a tax increase. It is, a, it is a, 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 a eliminating a tax a decrease that was there. This is why I'm voting red. There is no oil that is accumulating on the seafloor. We have no evidence that there is any oil that is sitting on the bottom or sinking down to the bottom. And you should too, or this country dies again. This will be all about socializing. Uh, Like it did in 1790. Would be about basically taking over and the government running all of your companies. Yeah, like how you defended a rapist, a molester. But we have oh, to actually, pass the, the bill so that you can Democratic uh, find out what is in it. Right? I, I love these members that get up and say, read the bill. What good is reading the bill if it's a thousand pages and, and you don't have a two days and I love listening to their stupidity. To find out That's what why it means I'm after you read Democrat the bill. again. Ever. You talked about this incident aboard this Northwest wants, flight, and you said and when it came right down to it, the system worked. A lot of people don't think the system worked at all, that the only thing that prevented outright disaster was luck. You would then concede that the system prior to that, the system that's supposed to prevent something like this from happen, happening, failed miserably. He was definitely not the lesser of two evils. So the bottom line is this, the southern border is more secure today than at any time in the past 20 years. <laughs> Homes that are occupied <laughs> may see an ebb and flow oh, in price at a certain percentage level. Yeah, but you're not going to see the color that you see when... Okay, okay. I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to run down the comments for you. Rich Patterson, three years ago... <laughs> There are so many about her Democrats on here. Patrick Luna Turnham, or whatever the hell his name is. His name is, I'll just call him Patrick L. Or Patrick Lundy. Only four minutes and 55 seconds? The Republicans saying stupid things are hours and hours long. Just Bush takes up 16 hours. Well, I wouldn't doubt the endless retardation of George 43. This is my reply, by the way. His father and brother's idiocy easily take up another day and a half. Ha! <laughs> Simple fix. From Jerry McMastigut. Stop voting for idiots to represent you, Democrat or Republican. Oh yes, stop generalizing everything. There would be a video of Republicans saying stupid things. You mean everything they say? Democrat voters are idiots, simple. You don't just hell with and uh, better insulting the markets in the comments, but if you go the e video about Republican by and stupid, the funding comments are fairly hateful. <laughs> Typical Democrat. Thank you, Brendan Colford. Thank you so much, man. God bless you. Ah, oh, I can't even begin to describe the idiocy of people who vote Democrat. Their their idiocy literally is bottomless. You cannot you cannot in hell vote Democrat, or you're gonna get raped up the ass. This is what happened to 69 and a half million people. When they won, when they made one big ass mistake of all time by voting fucking Barack Obama to the president, see, see. I mean, it it might as well be an extended episode of another series on YouTube, but this is Savage Level Mega Knoll, and I have no chill whatsoever because I'm not supposed to have one. <laughs> This, this post from a friend, Maga Patriot Steve, you know, this, this sums it up perfectly. A 
I'm sorry, but the ad Christian Ford is putting on is worthy of an academic award. Of an Academy Award, no less. It's clear she is playing the part of a deeply wounded soul unable to function normally since the 36-year-old attack. So how the hell was she able to struggle through two master's degree and a PhD? I'll tell you, she never got one. She never got her bachelor's like everyone else. She never got her master's degrees like anyone else. She never got her doctorate and her PhD like anyone else. Because in reality, she slept her way to the top. Dr. Christine Blase Ford will forever be known as the woman who cried penis. Let this serve as a reminder to all you Democrats to never conceive again. Seriously, just stop conceiving. Period. That's that's it, you know. By the way, by the way, it's it's worth noting. Dr. Ford never had any credibility to start with because she was in bed with Satan. So if she ever gets into prison, all these men and all these hardened women in those prisons, they're going to want to rape her. So yeah, you might not have gotten raped 36 years ago, but when you end up in the prison in the Huskow, you're definitely going to get raped until you're dead. Good luck with that woman. And you call yourself a doctor? Yeah, Professor Fraud, you're a doctor, all right. A doctor of bullshit! <laughs> they are complete, pathetic faggots! Right, well, I have one question. Why is Go Animate still a thing? I'll tell you why, because 20th Century Fox released a movie on the Go Animate website in 2006. They call it Go Animate the Movie! <laughs> And you'd think this would come out of Hollywood's anus hole, but no, it didn't. It came straight out of the internet. Let's just, let's watch bits of, cause this is, this is an hour and 40 minute movie. <laughs> I can't believe I'm going to have to sit through this. Check it out. In association with going, of course, obviously. Attention, all you folks at your theaters. I'm here to be reminding you, that the following movie may contain some follow-up tunes that would not be appreciated while you're watching. In fact that you're thinking if you're lying some content, I'm really thinking that I'm not kidding. No, really. I know that you guys are wasted to watch this scrap. But really, this movie have to rebound the fact of videos we did. And it's because all you guys at Go Animate are a complete bust. And so are you. Go Animate. Make your free animations. Go Animate. Make your free animations. Yeah! What the fuck is And 20th Century Fox released this movie to the public? To absolutely no fanfare whatsoever! <laughs> <laughs> I can't fucking shit for a week now. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> oh shit! I, I think I just pissed myself. Excuse me. I'll, I'm gonna go change my pants. I'll be back. Say hey, that kind of reminds me of something. You know. There's, there's this thing called democracy, right? You know, you know that, that tune that, that is the theme of Go Animate, right? Well, I'm going to parody everyone in politics in a nutshell. Go fuck yourself. Create your own allegations. Go fuck yourself. Create your own allegations. Yeah! Fuck off. But yeah, uh, that sums everything up to sum up in a nutshell, right? That sums everything up, doesn't it? That sums up this whole movie that I just had to sit through for the first two minutes in a nutshell, right? By the way, this movie absolutely sucks. I don't know why people use Go Animate. I don't know why Go Animate was ever a thing. Why was it ever a thing? 
Nobody's gonna tell me why, but I already know, so I don't have to be told why, because it sucks! <laughs> oh my god, man. You cannot, you cannot in hell make this stuff up. 20th Century Fox releases movies like this from Hollywood's ass every single year. <laughs> this is... <laughs> This is why I created Savage Level Mega Null for to, to, to do bullshit like this, man. <laughs> See, this is why the da this is why this company's in the damn state it's in because of bullshit like this. You understand? Oh, oh, what's their heads? And the bar. Ramirez is a no-show! <laughs> yeah! Damn right. Because she knows she's full of shit. Of course she is. Because, you know, this, this is so obvious, right? <laughs> oh my god! Fabulous! Fabulous! <laughs> That Kavanaugh raped me when I wasn't in the same school as he was when he graduated. <laughs> Whatever! Whatever! <laughs> Dumbass! Burn her at the fucking stake! <laughs> Nancy Pelosi is a no-show! Ha <laughs> Yeah! Okay. Andrew Jans of California. A man supporting Nancy Pelosi! To earn back the trust of the American people, we need to show that we are criminals! This is what the fuck you are! <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, man. Remember on November 28, 2017, when the Trumpster, Donald the John Trump, ripped weak, no-show Democratic leaders from standing him up? They stood him up, and he ripped into their asses, including, wink, wink, Nancy Pelosi! Yeah! Of course, because because obvious reasons are obvious, right? Yeah, let's just, let's bring that guillotine in, okay? Bring the guillotine in, boys! Well, fuck my day! Okay, here we go! This is from my friend, Mr. Pixel, of a bunch of parents justifiably, in many cases, destroying their kids' electronics because they won't stop being morons on their freaking cell phones and smart devices all day doing nothing! See, this is how you should punish your kids from now on. Seriously, I'm, I'm not even kidding. This, this really is how you should punish your kids. Because they ain't going to learn any other way. I mean, God forbid you were to spank them. Then they call Child Protective Services and your kids be taken away from you! Political correctness is in everything now. It's just, it's unbelievable. Okay, check out Mr. Pixel's work. Okay. Michael? I think he's inside playing his Xbox, I forget. What the? He's supposed to be out here playing football with us. Man, I'm tired of this Xbox crap. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? What's he doing? Is he taking his Xbox? <laughs> You gotta play football or you want Xbox? Yeah, I want the Xbox! You want the Xbox? Yes, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm dead. No, I'm oh man, here we go. Let me see. Oh, you Let me see that. Yo, here Let me see we go. Let me see that. Let see that. Yeah. Dad! See, this is what you have on your own Jerry Craig, you dumb motherfucker! Yeah, man. You stupid son bitch! 
Your boy Hillary Clinton well, tell you, and your Jack Arthur on the wiretap. No, they don't want no Come more, on. man. Now you ain't got none. You think you gonna try to pay for your own shit now? Get out of my way! Oh my god. Oh my god. He's gonna just look at me now. <laughs> you both are freaking idiots. Go get him, daddy! Go get him. You broke that box. <laughs> I am done. I am done. You guys both deserve this anyways. The second time. What? Are you kidding me? What are you doing? Kurt! Stop! Get out of here! Legitimately, this is how you punish them. Because they're not going to learn any other okay, way. What <laughs> Danny, that could walk. That could walk. What are you playing? So you just picked up the camera just to... Now that guy is a real Pretty Democrat, much. right? Okay, hold okay. on. Oh, Tom Clancy's bringing up six away. siege. Okay. I don't, did you get that? Do you want me to zoom in? There it is. I got it. You got it? Yeah, I was able to zoom in. This new camera's pretty good, dude. Alright, cool. <sighs> oh! Oh, this no, kid's really old. gonna get it now. You get in here, yeah, let's, let's discipline the Democrat, man. Discipline that Democrat. Right. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. 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 Yeah, that's Oh, good, good, good. That's why. Multiplayer sucks! Hold on. Let me get out of this and just go in normal. Why do you play Black Ops 3, man? What do you Because I like Siege. Yeah. Siege is because... I like Siege because it's more realistic, you know? Like, you get to pull oh, up yeah. things and... Yeah, let's, let's, let's skip a little up. bit, right? Skip a little bit. Give me my games! Give me my games, give me my games. See, this is how you discipline a Democrat. When they won't get off of their One, damn games, the Two, and they won't the stop Go jacking ahead. off to a Barack Obama Eat or a Hillary Clinton or a Michael Avenatti or a Stormy Daniels or a Christine Ford, games. you discipline here, them like this. Here's your games. Here's this all is you. precisely here's how you ATV do it. Out of here. There is no other way. Like they will not combat. learn any other oh, way. This is how you do it. You understand? Oh, yeah. Here, another one. Parenting 101. Because in a world where spanking your children you is there. punishable by there. death, There's your you game. discipline them oh, by getting rid God. of their technology because they won't God. stop voting Democrat. Next time, you're going to go ahead and listen and learn. I'm tired of your damn smart ass mouth. Exactly! There, see it burn. You tell them, Burn, man. baby, burn. Burn, baby, burn. burn. This gold burn up, burn, baby, burn. Next time, when I tell you to come outside, when I tell you to come outside and join us on the bonfire instead of all day playing fucking video games, now you got your video game. There they are. I don't care how much it costs. There you go. Enjoy it. Damn. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Okay, let, let's, let's look at that kid's face. Look at the kid's face. Look at the kid's face. Look at that face. That is the face of someone who voted Democrat in 2016. That is precisely the face of someone who voted Democrat in 2016 when they had the retarded ignorance. The ignorance of voting for Hillary Clinton. The most unqualified candidate of any presidential or political office anywhere in the world in human history. Yeah. That's 66 million of you people right there, you dumbasses. Yeah. And you wonder why you're never going to get anywhere in life. Dumbasses. You need to be quiet. I'm sorry.
Because this is ridiculous, Jeffrey. Seriously. But that's the only console I have! But every time you do this, you fight and argue over See, this it, is how you do it, yeah! I'm going to break it and I pay for this every time. You don't need to break it! Oh, you can just put it away! Get him, Mommy. No, I'm so sick and tired of this, Jeffrey. I'm serious. Every time. I'm trying to get the baby to sleep. You want to hit the damn thing. You want, you have anxiety. So do I. Teach him a lesson in the Constitution, buddy. Go ahead, Mommy. Go ahead. Do it. Do it. This is your last chance. See it? Give it a kiss. Because it's going. No. When they bought it, it's going in the garbage. Do it. Nope. Goodbye. Do it now. How about that? You Mom, what are you thinking? Mommy. Oh, and you're videotaping me? Do you want me to break that too? Oh, oh Jeffrey, don't eat it. It's my console also. God bless her. God bless her. Take that, Mom. That's fine. I'm going you no more stuff. I'm I'll done. give a hell. Jeffrey. Oh, my God. Come on, buy that. See, these people wow. don't know yeah, anything else. They that. told the Democrat. 28 is that years, this is what happens. Fucking reality check, people. Too. Reality check! When you believe a man who wrote the Constitution but had to make the equally fatal mistake of including democracy in a constitutional republic that would be useless with it and perfect without it, you know you're in deep shit! Democracy died in Thomas Jefferson's womb. There you go. You're welcome. Stop the hammering!